Hey guys, this is Epson Workforce WF2910DW. I'm going to show you how to connect this printer to Wi-Fi Direct. This printer is currently connected via wireless network. First of all, I want to disconnect the Wi-Fi networks. So use the side arrow button, scroll to the side to the settings. Select OK to the settings, scroll down. Scroll down to restore default settings, select OK. Scroll down to restore all network settings, select OK. Processing. So now it's restoring all the network settings. Processing, please wait. Settings restored. You select OK. Then you go back to connect it to Wi-Fi Direct. Then you use the side button arrow, go to the settings select ok scroll to the side again to network settings select ok print status sheet scroll down wi-fi setup scroll down again it will show you connections checking so scroll to the wi-fi setup select ok wi-fi recommended is the first option select second one again wi-fi direct select ok Connect printer and device directly when you do not have Wi-Fi network. Then you select OK. Smart device connected with Wi-Fi will automatically be switched to Wi-Fi direct. Then you select OK. Setting up. So it's setting up the Wi-Fi direct. You can use your printer Epson Smart Panel. Then you select Done. Now this printer is connected via Wi-Fi direct. I want us to print status report, print status sheet, select OK, print network status sheet, select yes. Now it's printing the network status sheet. So the information we need is right here. So I'm going to cancel the next. So the information we need is right here. So now from this network sheet, if you look, wireless network is off. If you check, Wi-Fi Direct is on. And Wi-Fi Direct name and also the password is available here. The next thing we need to do is to connect it using the mobile phone. You need to go to your phone settings go of your phone. Go to connections. Select Wi-Fi. And it will show you all the Wi-Fi network available. So you need to wait. Direct Epson WF2910 series. Select on it. Now we need to put the password. So it's asking us the password. So you look. On the password that we printed out, we need to type in the number. Just press the I sign. Once you type the password, press the I sign to check the information you put, if it's correct. And once you're happy, then you select connect. Internet may not be available. Select connect using this app only this time or connect always connect only this time connected without internet so this printer now is connected without internet download Epson smart panel to your phone open it up then select add printer already on a network and Epson workforce series select on it select done and it's showing us the printer here so to print to print documents select print so select the document you want to print change the size change the size to a4 paper then select done 
Penselet Print. So this is the document we printed out using Wi-Fi Direct. If you want to scan document as well, then you go back, then you go to Epson Smart Panel. From here, you can scan document. You scroll down to the side and stick the document you want to scan. Stick the document you want to scan. Scroll to the side and select scan. Go to the settings. You select the color standard, then select start. If you want to scan more, you select add scan. Open up the scanner, then stick the second document you want to scan face down. Make sure the document starts from the from the bottom right side. You will see a white arrow on the right side. Make sure the document starts from this end, then you close it. Then the next thing you need to do is you need to go to your phone and select add scan. Now you select next. You select where you want to save this document. Select save. The file is saved. You want to go back from the home page. You can select no, yes or no. You select no. If you want to share this document, then you select share this button. If you want to print it out, you also need to select print. If you select share this button, you scroll to the side and select share to email. Then attach this document to email address. You put the email address of the recipient. Then select send. Okay. So now this document is sent to my inbox. It will ask you, do you want to go back? You select no. Select share again. To print it out, look for Epson Smart Panel. Now this document is attached to Epson Smart Panel, two pages. To print it out, then you select print. Then scroll down. You want to print this double-sided, long edge. Then select print. going back in to print the second page. There we go. This is the document we printed out double-sided. We scanned this document and printed it out double-sided. So this is how to scan your document, print it out, likewise share this document via Wi-Fi Direct. If you're happy with this, Please do me a favor, like, share, and subscribe. It helps the channel. Thank you.